How's it going guys? It is uh, Monday, currently 12.30. Here we go again. This is exactly why I wanted to get off of OTR and have a dedicated route because of the amount of time that you sit. So I was up at six o'clock this morning. I've been used to getting up early for the dedicated route so I can get off the road early. Contacted my fleet manager Actually, I talked to dispatch first because he hadn't gotten in yet. They said that they had a load for me to pick up about an hour away from where I was at, but it was a live load at 5 p.m. It was an appointment and you couldn't pick it up any earlier. And it uh, didn't have to be delivered till like the 12th at 1 a.m. And I'm like, I want to start my day off. I don't want to wait that long. Do you have something sooner or earlier? And he was like, no, not at the moment. I'll let your fleet manager know when he comes in. So eight o'clock rolls around fleet manager calls me he says hey man I'm working on a load for you to get you moving sooner I was like all right cool 830 rolls around he says hey come down here to FedEx pick up an empty trailer because I was doing pickup and drops uh, for the dedicated route so when I was parked I didn't have a, uh, a trailer so I came over here FedEx there it is right there FedEx picked up my empty trailer calls me back he says hey I've got this run that is almost uh, just like the run that you had before it picks up in a different location and it still goes to uh, Monroe Ohio I'm like awesome cool thanks for you know getting me out of here sooner so I drive over here pick up the empty trailer at 9 o'clock he told me on the phone it was a live load at 12.30. It's 12.30, by the way. I'm still sitting here. I sent numerous messages, tried calling. He has sent emails to the planner, but has not got word back from them. So I have no clue where it is I'm supposed to be going. I don't know how far away it is from where I am now. And it's 12.30, so I'm obviously not gonna make up this pickup on time. I literally have been sitting with the trailer since nine o'clock. Three and a half hours of just sitting here with my clock running, time wasted. This is what frustrates me. This is why I wanted a dedicated route. This seems to happen all the time. I have about I have about another hour, uh, hour and five minutes where I can sit here before it starts affecting my uh, 14 hour, or I'm sorry, before it starts affecting my 11 hour clock. As you know, you can only drive 11 hours a day. Half of my day has already been wasted sitting here. And like I said before, I like to try to get off the road by four o'clock because it's hard to find a parking space. So this is just frustrating. This is why I'm seriously contemplating going and working locally somewhere where I don't have to worry about things like this. Yes, the pay may be less, but I have a place to go home to every night. I either get a flat per, per day rate or it goes back to hourly. Regardless, I'm not sitting not getting paid for it. This is what continues to happen and it, it, it frustrates me if you work for this company you do not want to be up here this far north because it takes them forever to get you down I finished off Friday there is nothing going out all weekend long today is now Monday Pennsylvania and up just don't take runs because you're not going to get out of there if you do make sure that they have a guaranteed pre-assignment on you already to get you back down Pennsylvania, New Jersey, New York, any of those states up there, just don't even take them because you're going to be sitting here, you know, waiting. So sitting here waiting for the directions to come by so I could get moving on the road. And it's raining. I hate getting wet. So this has been the start of my Monday. So hope you guys are having a great Monday. Um, but again, like I said, this is a prime example of reason why I wanted to try the dedicated route so I wouldn't have to deal with this. 
It is unfortunate that the contract ended. I don't know what happened. They told me it was going to be permanent, and apparently that wasn't the case. So, but uh, anyways, guys. Uh, so I just want to come on, rant a little bit, and uh, get off of here. So I appreciate you guys checking out my videos. If you haven't done so yet, like, uh, ring the bell, you get notified when I put new videos out there. And I will do my best to post more, more videos uh, to try to help uh, new guys coming out into the road and uh, a little bit about the company that I am currently working uh, with. So, all right, guys. Well, again, thank you for checking me out. Uh, you guys be safe out there. Look out for yourself and one another. And until next video, Trucker J is out.